I'm Casey. And I'm Kiana. And welcome Inside, Inside Our World. Everybody, we have a special guest for you today. He's a signed recording artist on Jive Records. He just got finished with one of the hottest teen shows with Diggy Simmons. So please help us welcome Jawan Harris to Inside Our World. The very first time. <laughs> <laughs> Do they call you Jay or is it just Jawan? Um, no, they just call me Jawan. They just okay. call me Jawan. Well, I'll call you Jay for right now. <laughs> <laughs> um, how did the music, how did you start in the music business? I, when I was in Chicago, when I lived in Chicago, as I should say, um, I used to go to a school called Humphrey Middle School. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I actually sung the national anthem at my school. And, you know, our school ended up winning a contest out of the whole USA. A teacher that knew my now manager, Keith Thomas. Keith. Keep Thomas, I'm sorry. <laughs> and you know, she brought me to him and he walked me through the door. Last little Marcia. Can I call Ooh. you? Would that be alright? Right. Maybe Friday or Saturday night. Girl. So I hear your mother is a beautiful singer also, but who are your musical influences? Other than my mom, I'll have to say Michael Jackson, Usher, Chris Brown. Um, Jasmine Sullivan, mm, yeah. the Park Sisters, and nice. Sierra Shear, mm -hmm. and many, many, many more. <laughs> Is there anybody in the industry that you'd like to collaborate with? Um, Justin Bieber. Mm. Um, <laughs> yeah. Sure. Michael Jackson would have been a great. Yeah. yeah. But, uh, <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> constantly filming and stuff. How did you keep up with doing your schoolwork and being on tour? Um, I like to say, pardon me, you know, doing all of this. In the morning, um, I like to say I do five hours worth of schoolwork. Mm, and yes. I do online tutoring. Oh, so okay. It's, it's kind of <laughs> deep, but at the same time, I do not have a chance to communicate with friends as if I'm in public school. Can you tell us a little secret about you that our fans may not know? I'll, I'll, I'll have to say, do chores and clean up run outs and everything. What uh, you said, I still mm. got dishes in the sink. Yes, and <laughs> feeding the dog. Hey. <laughs> but we know you just kicked off your tour with Diggy. How was the experience and how are the, you know, how are the fans treating you? Experience, it was beyond great. I, I enjoyed myself, which I want to thank Scream Tour and Diggy for having me in the first place. Mm -hmm. um, if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have been on the tour. But, you know, <laughs> um, I thank Team Juwan also. But, um, Dave, fans have been treating me wonderful. Okay. And I thank them for that. <laughs> He's out! Oh, God. <laughs> I told you, I told you he did what I told oh, you. Okay. So what's next for Juwan? I have to say, I'm, I, think, I think they just put me on the next Scream Tour. Oh! Well, thank you so much for being here. We hope to see much more of you. Yes, and, it is. Oh, no problem. Thanks for coming inside our world. Bye! Bye. He's out! <laughs> Hi guys, it's Casey from Inside Our World. And if you're in high school like me, you're probably seeing posters all around your school talking about the most important day of the year, prom. However, I know there are so many different styles and types of dresses out there. So we are here at Unique Boutique in Bartlett, Tennessee. And I'll show you some examples of great dresses to have your perfect dress. Miss 
Donna Lewis, the owner of Unique Boutique. Susanna, how are you doing? Hi, Casey. I'm doing great today. <laughs> nice to meet you. Um, so how long have you been in business? I've been in business uh, over 20 years now, mm -hmm. Casey. Oh, so what type of prom dresses will we see around here, too? If you visit a Unique Boutique, you will see a variety of prom dresses. We have the mermaid prom dresses. Mm -hmm. We have the ball gown, the Cinderella type dresses the short dresses, the high-low dresses, and just a variety of colors on prom dresses. So pretty much anything that we Anything, anything you're looking really for, want. you will find it here. Can your items be purchased online as well? No, you can view the items mm -hmm. online. All of the prom dresses are for viewing only online, but as far as to purchasing the dresses online, we don't sell the dresses online mm -hmm. because of the reason if we'd like for the girls to come in the store and try the dresses on and make sure they have the right selection rather than just ordering a dress that yeah. they're not satisfied with online. Yeah, that's, that's the best way, because yeah. I know I'm out of, out of proportion altogether. But, <laughs> but about you, so who is your favorite dress designer? I can't say one in particular is my favorite because if I say that, the dresses shouldn't be in the store. True, true. So how do you make everyone feel like they're just, you know, special and unique in their dress? Well, they definitely would be special and unique because we make it a practice when girls come in to select their dresses that no one from the school have already been in the store mm -hmm. to choose that particular dress. We sell one of a kind for each style of dress that we have here. Mm -hmm. We would only let one girl per school purchase a dress. Even if the dress is in a different color, we still won't sell the dress to the same school. Yeah. So the girl will feel very special here uh, at the Unique Boutique. Ms. Donna, I've totally already picked up my sparkly dress just how I like it. But thank you for allowing us to, you know, see your dresses. Casey, you're so welcome. And I thank you all for coming in to uh, let me be a part of your world. <laughs> thank you. You are inside our world. Outside the home girl, of I thought you were bigger than that girl. The attorney I always talk about. We're outside the home of Star Keisha Jackson. Hey, the girl, I how you doing? What's up? Hi. The eyewitness of a hit and run this afternoon on Watkins and Madison. Star Keisha, can you tell us what you saw? Well, what had happened was I was running home from work and my boyfriend called me. You know, little Tony, he always worried about where I was. He was like, Star Keisha, Star Keisha, where you at? I was like, it's none of your business where I'm at. And can you tell me what you, you know, exactly what you saw? Oh, yeah, yeah, I was getting to that. See, what had happened was, after little Tony told, asked me where I was, and I told him it was none of his business, my phone flew into the other seat. And I was like, dang. And just then, I heard this ba bang and then I saw this car flying past me with all these other people. Ma'am, ma'am, what color was the car? Yeah, um, it was strawberry red, you know what I'm saying, with the big rims. What, what color? Strawberry red, you know, you know, it was like the Kool-Aid color, strawberry red. Oh. Yeah, um, and other thing is, can I give a shout out to, can I, hey mama, this is Stucky, I told y'all I was gonna be on TV tonight. Welcome inside our world. We have a special guest for you today. She's a 16-year-old published author. She's been interviewed by TV, news, and magazines. And guess what? She saved the best for last. Inside our world. <laughs> she wrote her book, Taken Away, in two months, going to school every day. And she also has one of the greatest names I've ever heard. Welcome, Ehi, to Inside Our World. Hi, glad to be here. <laughs> So what does it feel like to be a 16-year-old published author already? It feels great. I'm glad that I've been able to pursue my dreams at such a young age, and it just feels good. Have you always known you wanted to be an author, or did it just, like, pop up? Yes, ever since elementary school. I remember in kindergarten, I wrote this um, children's book called The Colorful Fish, and I colored it in and everything, but I stapled it wrong. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. That's so weird. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's young. <laughs> well, we see this book right here. Can you mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about it? 
Yes. Well, basically the storyline is Congress passes a law saying that any parent that makes less than $50,000 a year mm -hmm. isn't able to take care of their children. Mm -hmm. So therefore their children go to this stay in facility where they get a better education and lifestyle. But really the world's getting too overpopulated and they're planning on killing the children. So it's just their way of figuring that out and trying to escape. I was inspired actually in eighth grade in my American history class mm -hmm. and we were talking about the Trail of Tears and that's why that's how I came up with the storyline and everything. So. What advice would you give to other young people that want to be authors? Well, my advice is for everyone, whether you want to be a talk show host or an author, you just have to follow your dreams and don't let your age intimidate you. You can do anything at a young age. Mm. Live your dream. Yeah. Good advice. <laughs> <laughs> um, I also heard that you sent your manuscript like without your parents knowing. Why did you do it like that? Well, um, I found out that in order to, some publishing companies won't look at you unless you have like an agent or something. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. I was looking at publishing companies that sent, um, that accepted manuscripts and I saw a Tate Publishing did. So, you know, I guess I got really excited and just <laughs> sent it in right away without telling my parents. Great. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they knew I was writing a book, so. Well, it wasn't that That's big of a shocker. <laughs> it wasn't that big of a shocker. It's okay. <laughs> Where can this book be purchased? Well, you can find my book online at Amazon.com, mm -hmm. Tate Publishing's website, Barnes & Nobles, you know, other you know, bookstores that have websites. And locally, you can find it at the Urban Expressions Bookstore. Mm -hmm. There's one in the um, Raleigh Springs Mall and the Southland Mall. We will have the link to Ehi's fan page on Inside Our World for all of you who wish to continue to follow her. And thanks again for coming. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> okay, bye. Hi, everybody. Bye. Hey, guys, it's Kiana from Inside Our World, and I'm here with Little Peanut. So how are you? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm great. So what have you been up to? Well, I've been up to uh, making my new mixtape and doing a lot of more things. Yep. Okay. How has the experience been since you've been in Happy Feet 2? What's that walk it down? What's that walk it down? Well, I have I have a lot of, a lot of people notice me more now. Mm -hmm. and, uh, it just feels great being in a movie. Okay, I knew you played a part in the anti-bullying campaign. What would you like to tell the kids out there? Uh, I just want to say, stay in school. You know, do make good grades, listen to your teacher, and everything else. Okay. Can you tell us about your upcoming projects? Well, I have a lot of roles from a lot of. TV shows and everything. I'm working on my album and my mixtape. Make sure y'all copped it. So it's it's called the kids' point of view. So stay tuned to that. Y'all know what it is. Okay. Thank you for being with us today, and we hope you have a great day. You too. Peace out. <laughs> These cheerleaders are on a mission. Their mission, if they choose to accept. Is to cheer and entertain. But when mixed with the wrong substance, they're subject to lose their mind. And when they come down, they come down hard. Very hard. of eating too many calories and not enough exercise. <sighs> Thank. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, I forgot how long you cook it! I'm eating one more! I was like, it ain't none of your... Come on, Casey! I'm reading the same lines over and over again! <laughs> oh, sir, she... Can you tell me what you saw? <laughs> but however, I know there are so many different tiles... Tiles. What are tiles? However, I know there are so many different tiles... That gum! Hi. Oh, I don't say hi. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hi, everybody. Welcome, in. Welcome inside. <laughs> what is that? What's your name? Uh, excuse me, that's my initial for Malik Kiyambe Johnson. Uh, but I also. <laughs> <laughs> uh, mm, gosh, oh, hi. Yeah, let's start <laughs> hey, guys. I will be doing a. What the devil? Okay, 
Casey. I'm Kiana. And, and welcome, welcome to Inside. Inside. Hi. <laughs> 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 